Well, two women are singing the praises of female musicians, some who performed hundreds of years ago. And CBS 13's Rachel Wolf tells us about the Rogue Music Project. <laughs> it's a love affair with music and each other. She's unbelievable, the best I've ever worked with, hands down. Pianist Jennifer Reason. So I'm a musician full time. I host a radio show for Cap Radio. I'm the midday classical host. And opera singer and instructor Carrie Hennessy. I did the Metropolitan Opera auditions when I was in my very early 20s, did very well. These two kindred spirits have been hitting the right notes ever since they met at a performance years ago. It was the perfect meeting. It was a meant to be moment. It was, she was wearing bell bottoms and red leather boots and just standing there all spectacular. And from across the room, I was like, oh, you girl, me and you. And turns out she was having the exact same thought. <laughs> they had so much chemistry. We're both people that don't ignore those things. So when you feel a thing, we go. They formed a nonprofit called the Rogue Music Project, putting together recitals, gigs, and their latest passion. And yet she persisted, showcasing little known female artists from the 1800s until now. This song is written by Amy Beach, a concert pianist and composer. Her husband said, you can't use your own name, you must take my name. And the, you can do this many concerts a year, and these are as many things as you can write because you've got to throw parties for my people, because I'm a businessman. Other artists include Pauline Viardot, one of the most well-known voice teachers of her time, and a current work from Kendall A., a transgender poet. It's in perfect harmony with what is happening in modern times. Yeah, it's like the light has been turned from one group to another, and there's just all of these stars waiting to be discovered. They hope the energy of the performance ignites something in young artists. Come out. Tell the story that you want to tell. What's important to you? And that's what art is for. Striking a chord with the community. Bravo! Bravo! Well, they perform this Sunday at 3 o'clock at Pioneer Congregational United Church of Christ on L Street in Sacramento.